and welcome back. I am your host, Susanna May O'Hagan, and today we are going to talk about this. If you're wondering what this is, this is my purse. One of my purses, I should say. It is a purse that was hand designed by a local artist, but what's really cool about this thing, it's a studio, can't read it, but it's on the back. It is so pretty, it's pink, it's bunny. I thought it was adorable. But the thing that I really like is the fact that there's pins on here. Like you could put pins on there. Cause I have a couple more pins that I got or had. So I got this pin from my stepdad a little while ago and I finally found them all and I was like, yes, cause I didn't want to just put two on. I'm like, ugh. I know I had a bunch, but they were just scattered all around. I'll probably want to get another one of these or something for like pin collecting. Cause I do like pins, they're cute. And having a bag that can hold pins is also really fun because then you could take it without them falling too much, I think. So the question will be, where should I put these pins? We have this cool one right here. We found an old, old pin, and I do mean like old, because I'm older than what you might think, or you might think I am old, I don't know. I honestly don't care at this point, as long as people don't think I am a child, because I was younger, skinnier, and people kept thinking Jade was my sister when she was my kid. So I have this Disney pin from 2000 with my name on it. I know, I have a basic name. So basic. Hmm. Do you want to put it up here, over here, down here? I don't know. There's so many places you could put these pins. So many options. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, it's starting to look really cute, y'all. So, so far I have a cute Squishmallow that is a cute little pineapple. Uh, JJ from Kiki's Delivery Service. We got her and I think, she, I can't remember how to say her name right. I am terrible at names. But she is from Orient Host Club. So it's um, an anime. That is on TV has one season. Really wish I had more. And books. I like anime. Sailor Moon, but this is Sailor Mercury, I believe. Another Squishmallow, a little penguin that's blue. And I think this is KK Slider from Animal Crossing. And then we got some of my 90s favorites. Box Lunch. These are Powerpuff Girls. I love the Powerpuff Girls. Bubbles was my favorite. I know, I know. I should have liked the redhead because I'm a redhead. But I like Bubbles, Blossom, and Buttercup. Buttercup was just way so spicy to me. It was $18.99. But I got all three. And it looks like they're in like this kind of like dull color. It kind of looks dullish or it looks normal. I don't know. But I must have used like 90s colors really popping. And by that I mean like whew, bright 90s. But I might want to get another bag and collect more pins. Or get like a collector's pin like uh, Alvin. Butters Blossom and Buttercup. Powerpuff Girls. Professor Sugar and spice and everything nice. These are ingredients that create the Powerpuff Girls. But Professor added a secret ingredient. Not 
turn them super. I know I'm not saying exactly, but I also don't. Oh no, what fell? Something fell. Okay, you. Now I need to get Buttercup. The Rally Rough Boys. This is $18.99. Also, got it from Box Lunch. Love that place. They have some really cool stuff there. And let's see. I looked it up, so I'm going to tell you as soon as I find it. Here we go Brick, Boomer, and Butch. Brick is the redhead, the leader. Now, if I could figure out which other two are which. Okay, here we go. It looks like Boomer is this one and Butch is that one. They're the male counterparts to the Powerpuff Girls. I remember that episode. It's just been so long since I've seen it. I had to relook it up and they are so cool. lotion this morning to, you know, keep my skin nice and smooth and I have, apparently, my family and I just realized I have eczema, like really bad eczema, or like, so whenever I get a shower, I get eczema, and I did get a shower this morning, but yesterday I did, and I forgot to put on my lotion, so I'm like, oh, I better do it this morning. I never knew I had eczema until like recently, which is kind of funny. So, oh no, where did that go? Okay, but which thing do you go to? One of the new ones. I'm still getting used to how you put these on here because I haven't put any on in a while. Okay, I also want to get one for maybe just Disney at some point. Some of these might get turned into if I decide to become a collector of these, which I might. I might change it up a little. We'll see. Or I might just leave this one the way it is because it's my first one. Or put like Squishmallows on a Squishmallow one, the Disney on the Disney, and leave the cartoons with the cartoons. But we'll see. It depends on if I decide to. Because they have some really cool like Disney ones and other pins like Sailor Moon and other Squishmallows. So I am a little like thinking about collecting them. But these are the pins I have so far. So, Orian Host, Orian High School Host Club. This is her, but I can't say her name right. I never can. And it's not her fault. I just can't say names right. I have to look it up, and even then, I can't say her name right. Even JJ, it took me a while to realize that's JJ. Animal Crossing, Squishmallows, Disney. A tarot card reading, Powerpuff Girls, their male counterparts, Sailor Moon, KK Slider, and then, which I really like, really like, is you can put them right in here, try to match the face as best as you can, you zip it up, and ta-da! It did break because I tried to use it as like an everyday purse, which was so stupid. But I think if I find a keychain that I can put like right here for this zipper, at some point I might do that. But I 
think it looks really cool. You can't see all of them because the way it's set up, but like they're all there. Let me know in the comments below, should I get another purse to fill, a backpack, an album, and should I rearrange them into like categories or should I just keep this one the way it is? I think the purse ones are really cool because like this one you could even turn into like a crossbody or just like a normal hand. Like it does not have to be a backpack and I'll show you what I mean in just a second. That's also why I love this one was because it wasn't just a basic purse and it was handmade by like a s artist that lives in my area and I was like oh my gosh that is so cool like to me that is impressive like you could carry it like this or wear it as a backpack and I don't know if you could do a crossbody thing I'm really not sure because I think you could hook them both up and then make it like longer to wear as a crossbody so like you could totally use it in three different ways. I thought it was really neat. I hope y'all enjoy and have a great a wonderful day. And what do you think of my cool new pins? I think the first one I got was her because I love her but I can never say her name right. Actually technically the first one I really got was this but that was like years ago. But these are the newest all right here in a row. I know you can't really see uh, the last one, but they're there. Okay, bye for now.